Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, family and friends. Guess what I got here? Just last video I posted was the second shipment of the Cryptocurry on Partial Terror. And I got that first box I was telling y'all about at the end of the video. And I'm so happy I was able to grab this. So now I have all the things in a series. So let's crack this open. And if you don't know what Cryptocurium is and Partial of Terror, I'll put that in the link the description of the video. It's a new monthly subscription service where it's all handmade horror related items in the box. And they're really unique and highly detailed. And I really enjoy the service. I'm glad I found it. So let's check out what's in the very first Cryptocurium. This is the February bots. I just recently got the March bots, but this was a February bots that came out last month. So let's open it up and see what's in here. Shall we? It'll be great. Duck knife. Open them up here. Excuse my wolfed out beer here. I've been getting kind of wolfy lately. Okay, got them open. There's the little Cthulhu stamp. It's on all the boxes. Green paper and this nice first box here. Put it down here and I reach in and grab something. Got the flyer. It says thank you for your membership to Cryptocurry and Monthly Subscriptions Bot Service. Prepare yourself to receive the partial terror every month containing an assortment of handmade items that represent the horror genre of all its forms. From Lovecraft to slasher flicks, you can expect a wide diversity of ghoulish goodies in each box. I love that little Cthulhu tentacle on the end there. I say that every time I open a box. But I'm not going to read all this to you because it's got the description of items in the box. I'll read it while we go along. I'm going to reach in and grab this puppy that I see. The very first slasher magnet of the series. The Jason Voorhees, I believe it's Friday the 13th, part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan, depiction of Jason. And this is pretty, pretty damn awesome. So, let me take it out of the package and I'll read the description on the flyer for you. Alright, got him out of the package. I'm going to hold it up here and read it. And y'all can just get a look at all the details while you hear what the flyer has to say. Alright, it says... Jason Voorhees Magnet, everyone's favorite machete-wielding lunatic, fresh from the bottom of Crystal Lake. This is the first in a series of the Slasher Magnets available only through the Posture of Terror. So, get you a good look at this guy. Love all the detail they got in the mask there and the really dark, dark holes and the eyes. Looks really morbid. And the teeth poking out right here on the side. Pretty neat. And the chain. Just great detail in this stuff. Two big strong magnets on the back. I was worried about these things falling off my fridge, people. And they won't fall off. They're pretty secure. Unless you're a lunatic and slam in your refrigerator. It's not going to fall off. Next. Drop my flyer. The skull pin. It's the bloody, bloody skull pin you can wear on your hat or shirt or anything you want to look morbid with. <laughs> Let's read this for you. Okay, it says, Bloody skull pin, the gory dust head to adorn your favorite garment. So look at that guy. There's teeth. Magnet on the back there. White resin with this one. And it's got blood dripping down. So it's pretty nice. Good, good, good quality like always. <laughs> this is awesome. A gummy alien egg. <laughs> I'm not going to take this out. I really want to eat this. Y'all want me to eat this? I'm going to save this. Because in the last partial tear, I got to eat the chocolate. Uh... 
brain suck lollipop. And my girlfriend's like, I think that was good. It was good. I'm sure this is going to be good, too. But I'm not going to open this one because it's gummy. Okay, so. Gummy alien egg. Y'all can't really get the quality of that, but it's got details in it. There you go. I mean, it's got details in that bad boy. Alien gummy gag. The return of the candies from Cryptocurium. Garnish on this kiwi flavored xenomorph egg as you peruse your box of awesomeness. Oh, I bet it's going to be good. I'm not going to eat it right now. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm going to be weird about that one. That one is for me to enjoy by myself. I got a Cryptocurium glow in the dark wristband. Glows in the dark. So that's pretty cool. Put that on right now. Next. Anatomically heart keychain. This thing looks amazing. And it was February, so they threw in a gory heart keychain. It was last February's box. So don't get confused, everybody, for Valentine's Day. So let me hold this up and I'll read you what it has to say. The Ivan Conley Heart Keychain, because it's February. That's what it says on the box, because it was February's box. Look at that. Look at all that. You even got your vowels there on the top. Nice little chain here. <laughs> All right. Next. I'm going to save the wall plaque for last because that thing is awesome. I'm going to pull out this here print here. Slender Man print. Frameable Slender Man litho cut from the creepiest denizen of the internet. Hand painted and high quality cardstock, individually signed and numbered. Yes, the static noise you hear is totally normal. Slender Man. I gotta find a little frame for this. Keep those art in there as well, people. Ooh, this thing is beautiful. Look at this bad boy. Woo! The Cthulhu wall plaque. I gotta get a little look at this. I was getting ready to run out of the house and this thing dropped to my doorstep. I'm like, oh man, I gotta shoot this video before I leave the house and get it up for the weekend for all my cool viewers. You guys are awesome. Cthulhu wall plaque. Look at this guy. This is the first in a series of Lovecraftian monsters wall plaques that will only be available through the Parser of Terror. Of course, we decided to start this with the Great One himself. The Cthulhu. So, Y'all can't really see this. It's very, very, very bronzed. Like an old, like, spatina on it. Let's see if you can get a good look at it. I don't really have much to say except that this stuff you have to see in person, people. It is great. You put chips in the side, just like the last video I did of the amazing Is Mouth plaque. This one is just as damn good. And it was the first one. Got your little hook here. I actually put the O on the wall right there temporarily so everybody could see what it looks like in the video. It's really hard to see and it doesn't do it justice. But if you really want to get a good look at that bots, just jump back on the last video and you can see the, the March Partial Terror bots. So that's everything, people. Loved it. Partial Terrier is great. I look forward to it every month and I'm not going to cancel it. I'm going to keep it as long as I can. And by the way, people, I'm going to put the link below. He has a awesome available Friday 13th special magnet of Jason Goes to Hell. Right here, Jason. That's not the Jason Goes to Hell magnet. But the Jason Goes to Hell magnet is on the website right now. If you want to go over there, click it, order it, have it shipped to your door special. It's only 
what, 72 hours. So jump over there and get it. I have to have it. So Jason McKittrick, you know I put my order in already. But look at that. One last time for everybody to see since it's Friday the 13th. Jason. This stuff is awesome and I can't tell you how much every time I do a video I find myself just sitting here just kind of looking at it and I'm like I don't know I'm boring people but go check this website out it's awesome it's $35 shipped to your door with shipping you get all handmade items and yummy gory candies and it's all great everybody so check it out thanks for watching come back and visit your geeky neighbor sometime see you next time